But as long as the Fed is aggressively raising rates and shrinking its balance sheet by trillions and not even close to lowering rates, because you still haven't seen the core CPI hit a top yet, it's going to be impossible for stocks to go up long term in this type of environment since demand's going to continue to fall off a cliff. It's already fallen off a cliff in housing, autos, semis, which found in every tech gadget and product. Right now, earnings are expected to go up 7% in 2023 from this year. Earnings are expected to increase 2% in 2022 in this environment. But if you look at that number, which I told you, it includes energy, whose profits are expected to pop, I believe it's over 100% year over year. So energy is a very small part. It's still a relatively small part of the whole S P 500. But if you exclude energy, S P 500 profits are down 4% in 2022. But yet it's reporting that it's up 2%. And now you're reporting that on average, earnings go up 8% on average annually. So you really think that next year is an average year where rates have never been close to this high? Are you out of your mind? These estimates have to be revised sharply lower. 